In this New England 511 tutorial, we'll go over how to create and customize a trip alert. Go to newengland511.org. Click on the My Trips link. Log in by entering the email address and password you used when registering. Click the Login button. Now let's create a trip. Click the Add New Trip button. Under Step 1, either enter a custom name for your trip or select one from the drop-down menu. Under Step 2, select the state. Under Step 3, select a roadway, ferry trip, or Casco Bay Bridge direction. Under Step 4, select a segment. Click the Add button. You can add as many segments to this trip as you would like. Let's add another segment to this trip. Click the State button. Click the Select Roadway button. And let's also watch the reverse of this trip, Lincolnville Ferry North. Select the segment. Click the Add button. Now click the Save button. On the next screen, there are four icons or images. Hover your mouse over each icon to see an explanation of what each does. Press the pencil icon to edit, add, or delete segments to your trip. Press the double paper icon to duplicate an existing trip. Press the trash can icon to delete the trip. Press the bell icon to create and customize an alert for the trip. Click on the bell icon under the alert column to customize and activate your trip alert. Under Step 1, select the type of event you would like to be notified about. Incidents, roadworks, special events. I'm going to select all of them. Under Step 2, select the event's level of severity you want to be notified about. I'm going to select all severities. Under Step 3, select which days you would like to receive alerts. Click the Weekdays button to only receive alerts Monday through Friday. Click the Weekends button to only receive alerts on Saturday and Sunday. Click the Everyday button to receive alerts seven days a week. Or you can select specific days you would like to receive alerts on. I'm going to select Every Day. Under Step 4, select the time you would like to receive alerts. Select any time of day or select a specific time frame. I'm going to select 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Under Step 5, select the delivery method for the alert. Select Email to send it to the email address you used when registering. Select SMS to send it as a text message to the cell phone number you used when registering. Or you can select both. Click the Save button. That's it. You now will receive alerts for the trip you have created.